Hello, you're looking at uh, a system we just installed. It's SolusMate. This is SolusMate out of the box. I did change one thing. I went for a dark theme rather than a white theme, but that is it. Now I made the fonts a little bit larger as well. So I've been in this one, appearance. Okay, um, I will go now to the GitHub of Eric Dubois, Ultimate Solus. And I'll start installing all the software I need, install all needed software, some nice themes and so on. And let's go ahead. So getting these little scripts, download zip, yes, save it, you do that. Go to here, then we have download, downloads, right mouse click, extract here, everything's still simple. Ultimate solar system, opening it, getting rid of this, opening that there. So, what shall we do first? Install all needed software is the most basic one. Then we have what I call an issue. Right mouse click. I want to go to the terminal in this folder. Can't be done. So, let's do it the other way. Let's go for system tools, make terminal. And then we are now in our home directory. So we're gonna CD to somewhere, I don't know, let's have a look, where can we CD to, where is the element that I downloaded, in the downloads, and there is CD ultimate, Solus Master and LS, we are where we want to be, get that here, get that there, and now we're going to start whatever we want to run. So, install, what do we install? All needed software. Let's go. 40, 30, 30, 30, 43, that's it. Not 34, 43. Packages have been downloaded. Not yet. And they will be installed. So, it's a little script that just does the normal thing. And what is the normal thing? The normal thing is to sudo apt-get or to sudo pacman-s or stuff like that. But here it is sudo eopkg. Eo stands for evolve OS and pkg stands for package. So eopkg and then install if you want to uh, write it in full. And there's a shorter version IT, like IT crowd, IT department. So install. IT. So that's what's in this line here, in the scripts, and the scripts, well we can open it I suppose, I hope I've done it, yep, I've done it correctly. So EOPKG, I've done it in long, so you can learn, still, still figure out, so read what it is, install or IT. And the minus yes just keeps, uh, uh, avoids me having an interaction with the script. I just want him to install everything and then take a cup of coffee and when I come back everything is installed. That's what I want. That's why the minus yes. Okay, so he's always answering by default. Go ahead. And here you can put anything behind, whatever you like, whatever you dislike. For instance, you don't want to have this then you just make that blue and uh, look is not that great I'm no more of an oblivion kind of guy or solarized kind of guy now it's better to read we're installing package 11 of 11 so we are not nearly finished he's going at it again because there are still things to do we are at arc plank that means we're here He's installing all these lines one by one, so I could just walk away from my computer and come back. Maybe a good thing just for the movie's sake to pause this. And we're back. Script ended with evil pop, and what he did, what the what did he end with? With evil pop. So okay, fine, nice job. Don't close the terminal because otherwise we have to go again. And figure out where it is again so this is okay that's done close without saving did I save anything I don't think so voila so this is done we want to have these nice themes as well 
we want to have some software maybe from not from that one but from this one so there is in the system here let's have a look where is it again software center here in mate and there's this third party or you just click 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 whatever you want or you install some you install all of them in my case i have to install all of them just because i design the icons but normally i should advise you not to run this one and um, well you have already a lot of software but what you don't have is the nice stuff indeed so the gtk arc flat tablets is just created only a day old and it's a little script that gets everything from uh, a github and it's a variant of the art team from Horst 3180. There we go, and this is actually the creating of the GitHub, of downloading of the GitHub, running it, making it, building it, done. Next up, I'm gonna check later. Next up is GTK, the red version is also a very beautiful one. Some of people say, oh, it's not red, it's pink, but it's it's uh, a soft red. Let's agree on that. And then, boom, boom, boom. what else would I install? The Plank Teams is an interesting thing. If you want to use the Plank, of course, you'll see in a bit what the Plank Team is. I'm wondering if I added an element, if the, yeah, yeah, okay, I've, I've made some lines if the plank is not yet installed then the folders will be made for you and all the rest is not needed but the thing you should do now you we've installed a lot of software and that means that a lot of icons are wrong or are good depending on what icon theme you've chosen can't see any obvious things so you know what I mean dun, 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 dun. don't think this is part of the theme I know but if icons are missing or are different then you should actually change them and what should you change you should run this hard disk uh, hard code uh, fixer version 1 but let's uh, let's wait uh, let's do that for another time let's first do this and that and then you'll see what i mean with an hard code fixer okay so we're gonna install the sardi icons they have been updated for solos i think well, i don't know 10 20 well, a lot of work went into it to make sure that all icons are uh, available for this uh, distribution and and the other one we're going to install as well is the surfing. Same applies here. If I make icons, I do them for both of them. Well, good example. GitHub is a bit slow. You just stop Ctrl C and you run it again. And that's the speed you normally have. There you go. Then this is something extra let's wait for that to 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 see what this already do does then. so okay let's have a look what did we install we installed a lot of software but let's change first the looks look and feel appearance from time to time you want to change and we can change now to an arc red dark or also um, not that's not yet installed there are other versions i've made and then icons we can now change to Sardi, Sardi Colora, Sardi Arc. Let's take now, let's take um, something that's obvious in colors Sardi Flexible. Sardi Flexible is a way to see for me are the icons in order. Everything is blue, uh, one thing is not in order. As you can see, it's the only one. How do we check also? We go to places, home folders, other locations, computer, user, share, applications. This is also an interesting folder to check if something is wrong. 
So clip it, we can fix this, open with other application, view all applications, visual code. I have to fix this Pluma, I know it's on my to-do list. I wanted actually to have Sublime Text to open this, and well, this one as well. When, but I can't, it's not yet installed. So I go to my to my administration, yeah, software center. So everything is, is fixed here as well, all the icons are okay. And a sublime text here, yeah, it is. So we're going to install for the first time something from the third party software center. It's the script I've not I didn't run as of yet. Uh, probably do it later. It takes some time. He has to download everything, compile everything. It takes a lot of time. By a lot, I mean about an hour, I think, to install everything. Maybe half an hour, an hour, I don't know. But it takes a long time. Not suited to film. But this should be not that long since it's just one application. And I want to have it to show you guys how to fix this clip it icon so I want to open it to be to be able to open it with sublime text and here it is already okay cool so let's make it a lot bigger for you here it says I can clip it icon what I try tree icon blah, blah. clip it tree icon and get rid of this I save it I say my password voila done what happens clip it changes nice icon yes and here's clip it and it's still okay so everything you copy paste is then to be checked here to be copy pasted again for later color codes is interesting when you work with uh, color codes so uh, is it fixed here yeah it's fixed here so clip it is done it's, it's uh, settled and now we know that all icons adhere the sardi uh, look and now we can go change and do com something completely different preferences look and feel appearance and change any of the icons to this i don't know why not sadly mono new mix to have some color now everything is gray on this side but the places are so nice you recognize the new mix folders of course i'm sure so a lot of possibilities in the Sardi icons and there is also the surfing icons. Let's show that as well. Uh, look, feel, appearance, customize, icons. Scroll down, Evo Popist, I think, an interesting icon theme. And we have here all these icons now, completely different icons. And everything works, control center is nice. Where is our software center? Here it is, still working. You're already installed, my guy. Okay, so whatever. Uh, I can't seem to be able to do anything about that. But as you can see, the icons are already there. Everything is okay. This as well, all the icons are working. So that's, uh, that's that. I think we have installed a lot of things. We fixed icons. We've done this, well, we haven't done that. Um, that will be only necessary, I guess, if we're gonna have an uh, installation of, of the elements here in the, not here, but in the software center. These icons are often not correct, so we have to fix them with this hard code fix. And for the rest, yeah, we have Flatablus. We've installed Flatablus as well. Didn't show you. How does that look? Okay, customize. Where is it? Here. Flatablus dark. And now we have other icons at the top here. I should. We should see other icons on the top. I don't think we did. Uh, we do. Let's have a look. In budget anyway, we see another look, depending where we are, of course, we will see it or not see it. Is this different? Is this different from this? Don't think so. So it's uh, a budget thing and not a May thing, we'll not see it here. Okay, whatever. Mm -hmm. 
Okay, close. Anything else we have not discussed? These are extras. Sadly, is meant to be an, uh, a theme where you can change the folders, an icon theme where you can change the folders to a script. So if you install the Sadly extra, you'll have a lot of things extra. <laughs> Hello. I can set the extra. Let's quickly clone it. Everything from the net, from a GitHub, is going to be installed on your system. It's a bit too much, but you should just get rid of everything you don't like. And what did we get? What is happened? We have possibility now to show you that there are other Sardis. So, 65 of them. So this one is, we can see what happens on, on the back side here, on the, on the back. Uh, let's switch again, like this, okay. Ah, so check it out. Extra, this paper icon, a mixture of icons. This is um, a script we ran, uh, another mixture, script we ran, script we ran. So you can change all these icons, they're the same look, so nothing has changed. The only thing that has changed is that changed through the script is an hexadecimal code of colors and that's it. You just choose how you would like to see your colors and that's what Sardi is all about. The icon team Sardi is made for you to experiment with colors. Experiment with changing and desktop tuning and so on and so on. As you can see there are a lot of possibilities. The only here, here Sardi has stopped. So a lot of possibilities in Sardi Extra. Okay, that's a set. What's next? Back to the download. And then, mm -hmm. we install that, install that. This is another project, best go to eric.be, eric.be, to see what you should know about i3. It's quite interesting. So we are on Mate already clean install this so uh, this is actually to install mate starting with budgie and this would forget this at the moment and the install software from solus unstable i wanted to have um, the latest kernel and the latest kernel was still not available in the stable one so i had to do this little trick to get the kernel and that's the third party software, I explained that. If you want to have an other terminal, not bash, but ZSH, you can do that as well. We haven't seen the plank teams yet, and that's the last thing I'll show you. So this we can close. Plank, where's the plank? <laughs> yeah, there's the plank. So this is the plank, you can edit with control, and then keyboard control, right mouse click, preferences, default and these were the themes so a lot of possibilities depending on the I like this one depending on the wallpaper at the moment and so on you can decide what theme you're gonna use for the plank you can pin of course programs here as well I guess nope 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 minimize maximize so on top Nope, the pinning is in the budgie and it seems it's not available in right mouse click. There you go, there it is. So in budgie you can right mouse click here. In mate you have to go to the internet, Firefox, add this launch to panel and then you have this nice little icon. So you want to have it, you know, I want to have it there or you want to have it on the plank, it's up to you. And that's concludes our movie if I can.